Hi, my name is Orbe. We have a new product called Soft Lacquer. So different little ways of, of how I like to use it. One way is I use it on myself in the mornings. I comb my hair, part it in place like I always did since I was a little kid, spray the soft lacquer through my hair, walk out of the house wet. As the day progresses, I can run my fingers through the hair, the lacquer breaks up, and the memory stays. It's soft but yet has a lacquer and a shine to it. Today I'm gonna to show you different ways of using it to get great performance, tremendous shine. You're gonna love this thing. You can use soft lacquer to blow dry hair with. Take dry hair with a bend to it and blow it into the hair with a blow dryer. Spray it on the hair shaft. Take a flat brush. In the summer, when you really want to blow hair straight and keep it straight, great product. It has the shine of lacquer, but yet the softness. Another way of using it, spray the hair. Take your hot iron and iron your hair out. It straightens the hair, keeps it shiny and soft. Really seals it. So humidity doesn't penetrate. Super shiny, super cool. It's here. This product was tested in Miami where the humid weather is our worst enemy. This will keep the hair from frizzing, keep it shiny and straight. Don't be afraid of the smoke. See the luster there? There's a reflective aspect to this product that really is what gives hair shine. It almost starches your hair straight. That's pretty straight. And soft. So you've got lacquer and soft. This product has a stick to it. The stick is what makes it work. It's a hairspray that without this stick, it wouldn't do the, the, the same thing. So don't be afraid of the stick. That's what's gonna make it work. For those hard to do side bangs that are kind of plastered and shiny and you want them to hold, that this is the greatest product because it's got the stick to hold them. You get a great shine. You can use it at the end to hold it in place. When doing these kind of styles, you want things that will stay no matter what. You want the shine, you want the control, you want to be able to really define the hair. Again, this isn't a style, it's just a, a certain type of bang that you might want to do. Say you've done this and you want to soften it up. Again, that's where the softness of the lacquer comes on. It will break up. If you touch it, it'll soften up. So you've got a product that does a lot of different things. I just did, Sunday I did Scarlett Johansson for the Tonys. I set it with soft lacquer. I took a curling iron, used it as a setting lotion, did it with a large barrel curling iron, and got a tremendous amount of shine, hold. She went out in the pool, it held, it was beautiful. Best model ever. Soft lacquer is a super modern product. It's the contradiction that makes it modern. 
It's a lacquer, like a, like a floor of a bowling alley. It has shine. I wanted something super shiny that I, if I wanted that, that lacquer look, I could have. But I also wanted it to break up and be soft. So that you could use it not only as a finishing spray, but also as a setting tool, as a heat, heating, starchy thing where you could starch the bang straight or add a crimp to a hair. It's a fantastic product. It's, it's a product that I can't keep my hands off of. I use it a lot. If you notice on the website, most of the work that you've seen in the last month or two that I've produced, it's all been done with soft lacquer. It's given me something new. It's given me an extra shine and an extra hold that makes things look modern and cool. It's a product to not be afraid of. Use it, experiment with it. If you find different ways of using it, please let me know. I'm always interested in finding new ways to use it. One of the things that you should be careful about when using this product, it's, it's not like super fine. It's not a spray that you spray and then take a brush to immediately to and try to, to rearrange it. This should be your final spray for a, for a high gloss look if you want to use it as a hairspray. If you want it to move, then apply heat to it. Once you apply the heat to it, or allow it to dry like in my hair, it will soften up. I just love it, I think it's great.